what? We could actually spend our whole lives trying to figure out another word for media literacy. But the more we asked, and the more we listened, and the more people described what they were doing, the more their efforts fit the definition of media literacy. So we decided we're going to embrace the word. We're just going to, you know, seize it. Spend our energy on raising that word up to the highest levels of educational discussions rather than on wordsmith. In one particular meeting, we wished that somehow we could all just connect with one another. All these different organizations around the country thinking they're doing different parts of media literacy, looking at their different slice of the pie. We found ourselves longing for like some sort of bridge, you know, some way that we can understand each other and our needs. I decided it was important to jump in, and I want to say the same thing right now about media literacy. It's important for us to jump in and just commit to the word. That's the word that we know. That's the term. And our focus for Namely is not just on media literacy, but the way we teach it, the way we share it with other people, the way media literacy impacts what happens in all educational settings, formal and informal. Lots of us are doing media literacy in informal settings.